Here we're going to talk about the variator belt removal on the Lexion 700 series combine. I'm on the right side of the machine here, and this procedure can be done on four different drive systems. We have the feeder house, the threshing drive, which I'm going to show you here, the cleaning fan system drive, and the rotor drive. The first thing I want to do is slow down the drive system speed in the cab to the slowest speed. I can tell that it's at the slowest speed because our variator belt is closest to the outer edge of the driven pulley. The next thing I want to do is grab a pair of pusher bolts, be found at our local Kloss dealer, install them on the driven pulley, tighten those bolts up, and this will spread the pulley apart so we can remove our belt. Now two things I want to remember when doing so. One, the holes are clean and free of all trash and debris, and two, not to use any power tools or electric impacts when tightening down the bolts. Now you can see that we've removed our pusher bolts, but our belt is still loose. To prevent damage to the belt, it's important that we go to the driven pulley and rock it back and forth or turn the drive system until the belt tightens up on the pulley.